One day, Lane received a mysterious text from an unknown number, urging her to visit Ancestry.com and take a DNA test. The message offered no explanation, leaving Lane perplexed. Curiosity peaked. Lane asked the sender who they were, but the reply was enigmatic. I wish I could say, but it's best if you just do the test. Have you done it yet? Initially dismissing it as a prank, Lane decided to consult her best friend, who, after hearing the message, believed there might be something significant to uncover. Trusting her friend's intuition, Lane decided to take the DNA test, despite her skepticism. She was intrigued to see what would unfold. This decision marked the beginning of a journey that would unravel unexpected truths and reshape Lane's understanding of her own identity. Lane decided to act on the stranger's mysterious message and purchased a DNA test from 23andMe, taking advantage of a sale. When the results came back, they revealed nothing unexpected. She was of English and Irish descent, just as she had always believed. This left Lane even more bewildered. Why would a stranger be so interested in her heritage? Despite sharing her DNA test results with the mysterious number, hoping to put an end to the strange messages, they persisted. They claimed that Ancestry had a different database and urged Lane to take a test there as well. Lane repeatedly asked the stranger to reveal their intentions, but they remained evasive. It's not my place to get involved. They insisted, yet they continued to pressure Lane into taking the test. They even went to the extent of creating a fake profile to message both Lane and her husband. Feeling increasingly unsettled, Lane decided to confide in her parents, hoping they might shed some light on the situation. Despite her parents' divorce when she was nine, Lane had remained close to her mother, despite her struggles with alcoholism. She called her mother, hoping for some answers. To her shock, her mother revealed a secret she had kept hidden her entire life. She admitted to having had a weekend affair with a 25-year-old man when she was 35 and in college. When she found out she was pregnant, she chose not to tell him. It was a one-time occurrence, but he had even seen her on campus and asked, is that mine? She denied it. This revelation left Lane feeling deceived. Her entire life, she had believed her father to be the one who had strayed. Now, she was unsure of who had betrayed whom, or even who her real father was. The truth had appended her understanding of her own identity. Lane's mother revealed that the man she had a brief affair with had suspected he might be Lane's father and had asked about it repeatedly. However, she continued to deny it and moved on from the situation. Armed with this new information, Lane wasted no time in ordering a DNA test to uncover the truth about her parentage. When the results arrived, Lane discovered that the man she had always believed to be her father was not biologically related to her. Instead, the man her mother had a short-lived romance with was her biological father. It became clear that this man was the mysterious messenger who had initiated the DNA test request, revealing the long-hidden truth about Lane's parentage. Further revelations unfolded as Lane learned that her biological father had been trying to connect with her for years. It started when her mother sent a Christmas card with Lane's name on it when she was just two years old. From then on, he regularly searched for her online, hoping to catch a glimpse of his daughter. When he finally saw a picture of Lane's face in 2007, he knew without a doubt that she was his child. Despite his attempts to reach out to Lane, her mother repeatedly denied him access and even threatened that contacting Lane could harm her mentally unwell daughter. Consequently, he resorted to following Lane's life through, longing for a connection he was denied. Despite the barriers created by her mother, fate seemed determined to bring Lane and her father together. In a twist of fate, Lane had attended beauty school in California in 2008, the same state where her father lived. This serendipitous connection was further evidenced by the similarities between them from physical features her mother couldn't explain to shared interests such as Lane's love for marine biology, which happened to be her father's career. They had even independently chosen similar names for their children, unknowingly linked by a bond that transcended their physical separation. 
Following the DNA discovery, Lane learned that she had two younger sisters around her son's age. Despite her biological father's attempts to contact her, her mother threatened him and demanded he leave them alone. However, in 2022, Lane's father decided to take action. He reached out to her, initiating a chance for them to finally connect. This revelation turned Lane's world upside down, impacting not only her relationship with her father's but also with her mother. Feeling betrayed by her mother's affair and the subsequent deception, Lane's trust was shattered, particularly because of the perceived manipulation that kept her separated from her father, who she had believed was close to her. The mysterious messages from the stranger ultimately paved the way for Lane and her father to reunite. However, due to the passage of time, their reunion wasn't as smooth as Lane had hoped. Despite her efforts to approach the meeting with an open mind, she struggled to connect with her father, feeling emotional and even crying in private as she watched him interact with his daughters. Despite the initial difficulties, Lane and her father now have the opportunity to make up for lost time and build a relationship if they choose to do so. The experience has been a profound journey of discovery and reconciliation, with the potential for a brighter future ahead as they navigate their newfound connection.